What's up guys, in this video, I wanna go over three mindsets of a successful fitness coach online. So whenever you look around a gym, you see different people every week, right? You walk in the gym, you're there typically the same time every day, you typically see two to three types of people, let's just say three for right now. You've got somebody who goes there and they do the same workout every single week for every single month of every year. And they look the exact same. And if you're somebody who's serious about fitness, you're probably low key judging them even if you don't want to admit it because you're thinking, why did they come in here and they waste their time when they could make progress, right? That's person one. Somebody you may not want to be like, right? You've got person two. Somebody who goes in there and they start a program, they stop a program. So maybe they make progress for a few months and they quit and they look the same. Or maybe they do extreme cutting, extreme bulking. So cutting is a term that you know, whereas you lose body fat. And then bulking is a term where you gain muscle. And so what happens is those are the kind of people who have these extreme approaches, but you somehow feel like they don't make progress either because there's never any consistency. And then you see the person who's doing something for three to four to five to six months, and then they'll change direction. And you see their body get better year after year after year, right? These are three kinds of people you see. Which one of those people are you? Are you the person who deeply wants to make real progress, but you're you're just doing the same thing over and over again without any thought behind it? Are you the person who goes in and you try really hard for a few months and you won't go in for a few months? Or are you the person who sets a plan in motion, you have a strategy, you create the right support system, and you follow through for three to six month time periods and you readjust based off of data and results? I'm guessing if you are the third person, you actually wanna be successful. If you're one of the other two, you may have a lot of mindset work to do to get to the third person. Now, the reason I bring this up is because in business, you are no different. You have people who have shiny object syndrome. They jump from program to program, from coach to coach, and they never know why they're doing what they're doing, but they're looking for a quick fix to make them feel good in the moment, but it's not getting them anywhere. You've got the person who might do a program for a few months, but when it gets hard, they quit, and then they just go the other direction once again, like the person before, but they do a little bit more time, so it seems like they're making progress. And you've got the person who stays committed until they get the result. So they may join one program, maybe two, and as they do it, every program they join, they're learning a little bit more, and it's like they're creating data for one direction. They're not changing directions. Now, obviously, I hired many coaches the last three years, so I've been through each of these phases. And until I became the third person with my business, I didn't succeed because I was trying to figure out things the wrong way. It's like, think about like if you look at PEMDAS and math, you're looking at the different strategies, right? Like if you don't put something in order of operations, it's not gonna work, but you may have all the right pieces. And so when you think of your business, think what are the order of operations that it's gonna require for me to become successful and consistently bring in revenue? And these are all questions you need to ask yourself before you wanna change directions. So I bring up this video because I think it's very relevant to people who work out. And honestly, it's no different from business. Whenever you train, there's a mastery component. Business is no different. It requires ruthless consistency and you have to care about the results, but also you have to value the process. Honestly, hope you guys have a great day. Just wanna share this video. I thought it would be valuable and I will talk to you soon.